Statistics tell us that of our total population, up to 20% of individuals suffer from a condition that can affect their health and daily well-being. That's one person in every five. The condition is sleep apnea. Now, the detection of this chronically debilitating condition has been made a whole lot easier with the use of a simply clever device. A device that is unobtrusive and easy to use, yet records and stores a wealth of highly relevant diagnostic information. ResMed's Apnea Link Plus with EasySense technology. So what is sleep apnea? What are the symptoms? How does sleep apnea affect you and those around you? Put simply, apnea means not breathing. When you sleep, your body's airway can become blocked, preventing normal breathing. You are temporarily deprived of oxygen and your blood pressure can increase dramatically. The brain reacts by sending urgent signals to your body to restart your breathing. You partially awake with a start, an adrenaline rush. Your breathing resumes for the moment at least until your next apnea episode. This pattern can repeat many, many times a night without you even knowing. But these non-breathing episodes mean you don't get the restorative sleep your body needs. As a result, your entire well-being suffers, both night and day. That's why diagnosing sleep apnea is so important. And that's exactly what ResMed's Apnea Link Plus has been designed to do. These instructions are intended to help you get the most from your use of ResMed's Apnea Link Plus. It will not only familiarize you with the device, it will also help you make sure you use it correctly and efficiently. So, let's get started. Don't worry, it's simple and doesn't hurt at all. When you open the pack, you'll find several components. Some are disposable, like the nasal cannula. Other parts are reusable, including the belt, effort sensor, Apnea Link Plus recorder, and pulse oximeter. We'll explain each of these parts as we assemble the system. The Apnea Link Plus recorder and effort sensor will most likely already be attached to the Velcro belt supplied. Now, before you go to bed for a normal night's sleep, you need to assemble and attach the other components. Locate the nasal cannula which measures airflow with the two prongs facing downwards like this. Loop the tubing over each ear and tighten the toggle under the chin. Make it snug, but not so tight that it's uncomfortable. Insert the end of the nasal cannula into the recorder by turning it clockwise. Your healthcare provider may have already done this for you. The one remaining task is to attach the pulse oximeter device. Place the index finger of either hand in the sensor and secure the line using the tape supplied. If your healthcare provider has provided you with a different oximeter sensor, please follow their instructions. Now you can attach the oximeter to the belt alongside the Apnea Link Plus recorder. If you're an active sleeper, you can also tape the nasal cannula tubes to your cheeks. The system is now fully assembled and ready to start recording. If you like, your clinician can provide more information on the operation of the Apnea Link Plus. The more you understand, the more likely you are to enjoy a total success with your experience. Turn the Apnea Link recorder on by pressing and holding the on switch until the green light illuminates. This will dim around 10 minutes after recording begins. If the light shows red, check that the pulse oximeter and finger pulse sensor are properly connected. Once corrected, the light will show green after a few seconds. If the light stays off altogether, the batteries probably need to be replaced. You can then sleep normally while the Apnea Link Plus monitors your sleep. 
checking breathing patterns, how much oxygen is in your blood, and recording possible apneas or other breathing abnormalities. When you wake in the morning, turn the recorder off by pressing the button until the green light goes off. This should take one to two seconds. Then remove the tube from your nose and the tape and sensor from your finger. Save all the components and return the ApneaLink Plus system to your clinician for analysis. If you'd like to go back over these instructions, please rewind the video now and we'll take you back through them. Now, the ApneaLink Plus contains a wealth of data on your personal sleep patterns. This can be downloaded and analyzed on your clinician's computer. Your clinician will be able to learn a great deal about your sleep habits and most importantly, identify whether you suffer from sleep apnea. If you do, the clinician may suggest that you attend a sleep lab for further analysis. But rest assured, there are simple therapies that can be offered to treat the condition and relieve you of the debilitating symptoms. Your clinician will happily tell you more. ResMed's ApneaLink Plus has been designed as a diagnostic tool to help monitor your sleep patterns and identify potential problems affecting a great number of people. The correct use of the ApneaLink Plus is essential. We hope you found this video presentation both informative and helpful. Please contact your clinician if you have any other questions.